friends, thanks for joining me today. I hope you have your hard hat because today we're going to read some construction stories. The first one I'm going to share with you is called The Construction Crew by Lynn Meltzer, published by Henry Holt and Company. Here we go. The Construction Crew. This old building's ready to fall. What do we need? We need a wrecking ball. Dig now, build later. What do we need? We need an excavator. Piles of earth, push them over. What do we need? We need a bulldozer. Move that boulder, away we go. What do we need? We need a backhoe. Tons of dirt and lots of muck. What do we need? A dump truck. Pour the foundation, that'll fix her. What do we need? We need a cement mixer. Pound that nail, drive that screw. What do we need? Oh, we need a construction crew. And look, they're all wearing their hard hats. Making holes sure takes skill. What do we need? We need a power drill. The roof is high, let's get there quicker. What do we need? We need a cherry picker. That's a machine that helps them get to the very, very top. We'll use our hands if all else fails. What do we need? We need a hammer and some nails. Make it flat, says the stroller. What do we need? We need a steamroller. Time to paint, watch the spatter. What do we need? Oh, we need an extension ladder. New home, good luck. What do we need? We need a moving truck. The moving truck is helping them bring all their furniture to their new house. New friends swapping favors. What do we need? We need cheerful neighbors. On the wall, let's hang a poem. What does it say? It says, home sweet home. The end. Did you have a favorite construction vehicle from that book? What is it? Oh, that's a good one, yeah. All the construction vehicles are very important. This next story I'm going to share with you is called I Love Tools, written by Philomene Sturgis, published by HarperCollins Publishers. I Love Tools. Tools, 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 I like tools. I love my ruler, I love my square. They help us draw a straight line there. The sharp saw cuts the line and the sawdust smells like pine. The hammer pounds a nail and then, oops, it pulls it out again. If it makes a mistake, you can always pull it out. The chisel makes a groove or two. Hmm, I wonder what they're building. Let's see if we can figure it out. The drill will drill a hole right through. Why don't you spread a little glue? I'll twist the clamp, I'll clean the ooze. Let's make a perch the bird can use. Hmm. That seemed like a clue to me. 
a perch that a bird can use? What do you think they're making? Let's see. The screwdriver twists in the screws. And sandpaper smooths it neat and clean. The paintbrush paints the outside green. Let's stencil on a leafy scene. Little bluebird, here's the best. Hmm, what does it look like? I think you're right. That's the best place you'll ever build a nest. That's right, they built a birdhouse. Look how pretty that birdhouse is. Tools, tools, tools. I love tools. The end. I hope you were able to come to the Comac building and pick up your crafts, and I hope that you have fun making all the different projects. See you soon.